Okay. <laughs> hey folks, it's Luke. Uh, you can probably bet for sure that wasn't my first attempt at doing that. Uh, and welcome back to Mo Astray, a game that is getting more and more interesting as I continue on playing as this slime ball in an alien world. I can read this person's brain. Their name is Tulagu. They're a gatherer. They're 85 years old. And also, again, a survivor. Probably, maybe a survivor of the event of the ship cra or the ship uh, coming to this planet, maybe. Not sure yet. Dry wind, sky people, always war, need more food. It's been rough times for everyone, huh? Okay, I acted as if I was out of the frying pan originally, but I truly am in the fire because I did not see this ahead. Uh, how do I even... Hmm. I have an idea. It's kind of goofy. Let me let me see what first happens when I land on this. Not a lot. <gasps> where is this going to bring me back? Oh, right back on your head. That's exactly where I want to start off. I love it. Wait a minute. I have a wacky thought. A really wacky thought. Mm, on second thought, it wouldn't be necessary. I was kind of thinking of bringing our friend there forward. Actually, maybe I do need to do that. I'm looking at this space here, and there's nothing to connect to. Yeah, I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Okay. Ugh! If I can do it properly. See, if I try to walk forward now, I'm going I'm going to hit this wall of spikes. If I move this upward using the opposite side, because getting down here isn't too hard. Once I bring this all the way up, I can probably bring our friend. What was their name? Tulagu, I think. Come on. Damn it. Not fast enough. That explains why it only goes down so far. It doesn't want me to end up causing me an issue. That was not good enough. That one felt good, but it wasn't. Well, that's fine. You know, something I've been wondering about a lot in this game is these vats here. Are these vats of me? Do you think they're just like vats of my, st of like the essence of myself? Essence of Mo? Ah, come on. Gotta go, dude. There we go. What was your name again? Tulagu. Now, can I get under this carefully? Yes. This is working exactly as I hoped so far. Please, for the love of lord, don't mess this up. I messed it up! Mm, okay. Alright, got to Lagoo again. How close can I get? Figure it out from here. Yes! Uh -huh. Out. Out, please. Out and ahead. Here we go. I always seem to end the previous episode right before I reach this thing on a very hard level. What are those? Oh, they're exploding. Whoa, that was close. These spores seem to explode with the slightest of movements. Good thing we're here. Jeez. Jeez. Oof. 
There's a whole bunch of them. Yeah, I kind of saw that coming the moment they appeared. Oh! Okay. So, even, even if I don't touch them... Whoa, I nearly just walked into it. Even if I don't touch them, eventually all the others will explode. And then they'll start sending off those crystal spikes. So yeah, don't touch that. Uh, really? Even out here? Okay. Melt them indeed. I wonder what this purple stuff is. What do these bubbles do for me? Oh, just as I hoped. It's really cute looking too. <laughs> Mo is adorable, even if they are a little concerning. Oh, you clever shit. Okay, I have to get to them before they do that, don't I? Or at the very least, take shelter somewhere? I might be able to take shelter here, actually. Yeah, activate it. Ha 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 ha, I bamboozled you. Who are you? Ariru. Guard. Genderless, 80, survivor. Brown plant, bad. Shooting seeds, hurt. Seed helps. Find the sky people. Uh! You know what? Um... Hmm. Hmm. I might have messed myself up. Ah! Really? Okay. It didn't mess me up, but it did cause an issue. Oh, that hurts them too. Why would they put themselves through with it? Go, 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 go. Damn it. Why is a ball of slime to be so sticky? This is the wrong place to be. Somehow it didn't kill me entirely. I'm actually... I, I think I somehow managed to get iframes there handily enough. Okay, I do need you. This is gonna be tricky, though. I have to... Hmm. Got it. I felt a little hacked, but I I guess that was the way. Hmm. Huh, look at that. There's um There's the goo here, meaning there's an eyeball near nearby, but this wall up here appears to be fake. It's not fake though, it's got like a like a weird ripple on it. What's this what's this? Whoa, look out. There were other monsters inside the tower. What is that? What is that? Can I... I cannot possess you. Well, I'm gonna go this way. This is where the eyeball is. Okay. Harper, cut it out. Give it back to me. You've put it up too high. I can't reach it. Hey, quit laughing at me. Harper, serious, help me. What? You're gonna laugh at me too? Give it back. Urgh. Director Greenwill's really gonna give it to me. Hmm. So it seems like the researchers that this person was studying with were was kind of treating them pretty awfully. Bullying them and putting things away from them and then laughing at them for it. Not a good workplace. starting to feel more and more like this person got added to the team as some sort of like token addition. Okay. What do I do about the creepy... Ow! The creepy rock. I need it to land on the... Actually, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Okay, that works. 
And then if I get far enough away... Haha! <laughs> now what, though? That worked. <laughs> is it still okay? What even is that thing? Uh, hmm. I don't think it's okay, though. It seems to have disappeared entirely. It's been so long, and I still don't get it. Whether it's those monsters we ran into before, or those other organisms, before they got in here, how on earth did they survive outside this tower? It all looks dead out there. It doesn't look like a place with life at all. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Whoa, okay. Oh, I get it. No, too far. Around here? Oh, I'm gonna have to do this a couple times, aren't I? <laughs> no, more than just a couple. I have to carry it across. That's fun. Wait, did I kill myself by accident there? Oh, shoot. <sighs> okay. I need to be paying attention to Mo as well while I do that. It's like I'm playing a DS game. There we go. Now I need to get a new one in time. Hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! Damn it! That was the correct move, but I didn't perform it properly. Uh, wasting time. more bubbles. I have to be careful when jumping into these because it does send my uh it does send my momentum going in the direction that I entered from. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is getting real platformery. Uh, uh, oh, I was not sure if there was going to be something to catch there. tell when these things are going to appear. It's kind of RNG-y, which is not ideal. I guess that's what I've got the spin... I guess that's what I'm supposed to use the spin for sometimes. <gasps> oh, it starts me off in one now. Okay, I like that. Ugh. At least I would if it worked. <laughs> Damn it. No! You know what? What if I did activate them real quick? Ow! This is a death chamber. Ugh! No, not like that. Don't don't say it quite like that. That's a bad thing to say. Um This is a place where I'm dying a lot. For freaking crying out loud. 
This is where my death counter in the game goes up to like a thousand. Okay. No. <sighs> Ah, okay. That's better. That's better. Wasn't that hard. Just had to really commit. That looks bad. They mentioned traps. Yeah, I can tell. Oh. Okay, I think they're trying to teach me about stealth. This one looks really old, too. Haha. <laughs> oh, did you see that? I leaped out at them with, like, an angry shout. Was it because I was angry that they hurt me? I was a little spooky. I I've been looking at Moe as really cute and sometimes a little creepy. But last time it felt kind of malicious. Wakaru Night Eye. Guard, genderless, 274. Yeah, very old. Survivor. Wait for enemy. Trap, no escaping. Not one. Well, I got up through. Heh <laughs> heh. Where am I going? Far away, I guess. Oh, is it my turn for the trap now? Hmm. I'm confused. Why is there one on this side? I can't even, like, interact with it. Well, something worth noting is that this whole area here is kind of exposed. There's no way I'm going to be able to jump across to their head in time. Yeah! Seriously, can I not hit this? Ugh, okay. Gotta think this through. Hmm. Too far for them to see me if I go past the trap. If I attach to the head, they don't care. That's interesting. Alex Fisher, fluid energetic specialist, specialist, male 45. We're running out of resources. We must cut down our numbers. Turn all the unnecessary ones into raw matter to maintain the project's operation. Damn it, Greenbelt. Your plan better work. Jeez. So Alex Fisher and this fluid energetic specialty. Ugh. You're one of the ones who is part of it all. Turn all the unnecessary ones into raw matter. Huh. What what a what a viewpoint. Jeez. And it was all for this project. What was this project that they were trying so hard to enable? What did they want to do? Okay. Ha ha ha. And now you're gonna make me Oh. Um, this is slow. This guy's going way too slow. This is taking forever. Mo, could you hurry him up? Wait, its knees are cracking. We better slow down. We need it to open the door. Come on, almost there. Just a tiny bit more. Finally. Mo. 
Don't you stick yourself on old coots like that one again. <laughs> That's really how you want to put it. <laughs> what a weird little exchange there. What a strange AI. I've been thinking more and more about this voice that's been speaking to us. I kind of wonder if they have something to do with um, the, the, the project that was transforming the children. Oh, so this is where we are. If we made it here, then it means that we finally cleared half the tower. We're still in the tower? Oh my god. This place sure went through a makeover. Couldn't tell where we were if I wasn't paying close attention. Surprised you recognize this, but at the same time, I'm kind of not. Yeah, that's right. The room with the smashy Flappy Bird pillars. Oh god. Okay, up to a great start as always. This isn't so bad, actually. Oh, it's kind of bad! mostly just intimidating. Once it gets started, it's not the worst. No! I need to aim a little higher there. Not that high. Ah, oh, the screen shakes a lot here. It's actually really... Yeah, if the two of them uh, hit at the same time, it comes out really weird looking. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Kinda sick of those things. Memory! Everyone looks so serious at today's meeting, even Harper. The research has been lagging behind for such a long time. Feels like there hasn't been a breakthrough development in forever. Dr. Greenbill is right. Perhaps we need to look at the fluid from a different perspective. Hey, Sirius, are you even listening? Did you think of something? What is it? Hey, wait for me! Why are you walking so fast all of a sudden? Hmm. Serious thought of a breakthrough? Whoever our character here is, though, doesn't seem to really know. Or hasn't been told yet. I don't know what that stuff does for me, but I still want to try to collect it. <laughs> okay. It's because of all the plants. Turned this place into a jungle over the last few years. Hmm. This place has had me confused for a long time now. Judging from the speed and weights the plants grow, the area outside should be as lively as it is inside the tower, but... But what? I'm not sure what to do here. Oh, the timing on that was very difficult. Okay. Things don't- things just don't add up. Just when the world happened. That left the outside world like this. That has something to do with the extreme energy. Oh bad. Oh bad. Panicked when that thing woke up. I forgot that those things wake up. Just gotta go, just gotta go, just gotta go, go, go. No! Ah! That's fine. If I can only remember the things before I woke up, then I might be able to help find some clues. Ow! You know what? I'll take some damage for this. That's fine. Hit! 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 Oh! No! Oh! It was so adorable and, like, elegant, and then suddenly it wasn't. But being here, uh, but being here for so long, one thing I can say for sure, this tower and those people and even us aren't a part of this world. No.
No! 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 This is not going how I want it to. Why can't I land on this damn mushroom? There we go. Yeah, so... We need to make sure that we intercept the right mushroom. And I think I know which one it is. Maybe? Because we don't touch this one. There we go. Oh, hi. Hello. These guys aren't too hard. This is their world, Mo. And now even inside of the towers is theirs. We're the unwanted guests. It's a very interesting thought. It's kind of true in a way. It's also kind of... Well... Honestly, what is Moe's world? Does Moe really have a world? This is the only world that Moe has known. In a way, you could say that it's a- oh! I should have seen that coming. I should have seen that coming. How am I gonna make this work without getting myself killed? Oh, golly. It'd be nice if I stopped taking damage, for starters. feel bad that I'm about to kill this thing, but it's the way forward. Come on. Turn this way. Oh, not that far. Oh, God. It does a lot of damage to me, too. I have to first lure it this way. Can I get closer? No, that's as close as I can get it. Okay, that's fine. Got it. Sorry, buddy. As to what kind of world this is, and why we're here, the only person that knows, the only one that's left, is probably that annoying lunatic, I think. Playing into my instincts, I see. Oh, golly. But, then, no, there was more down here. Ooh! This guy, I guess. Let's get him on the mushroom. But to what end? What is, where does that go? Here? Hmm. Let me keep exploring. So we have two different AI... One of which is helping me, one of which doesn't want me to proceed. Not necessarily bad, just not helpful. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, okay. I get it now. We need to get this big boy up here. Somehow. Ow. Oh, I killed it. Can I get it back? Is it one of those resurrecting ones? Yes, it is. Hi. Hi. Come this way, please. I made a mistake. Ow. Well, I made it. Now we go retrieve him from this side. Well, I don't know what it is. It doesn't... can't be a he. It's just a rock with an eyeball. Or maybe it is. Maybe it is. I don't know anymore. I don't know anymore. Gender the rock. Let's do it. I'll do it. Ugh! Thanks for the lift. Come on! Got it. Alright. Let's get out of this place. I hope we're almost done with it. This gimmick has been getting a little old. Just a little. Button? Actually, what does this do? Okay. I already see what we're supposed to do here. But I also kind of don't. Oh, no, I see. Oh! Okay, I should have seen that coming. So it only reacts once... Oh, yeah, there's some sort of thing here on the floor that 
indicates to it that I'm close to the button. Fascinating. How do I get out? He gives up after a while. Uh! Hmm. There is one problem, though, is that this one here in the middle doesn't light up, ever. I think I have an idea. This one's kind of annoying, I'm not gonna lie, just a bit. Ow. Okay. That's right. That's how it goes. Haha. <laughs> Got you. What's your name, you big punk? Ling L Lysinka Deep Carve. Builder, genderless, 190, survivor. Sky people left behind stuff. Dismantle, rebuild, make new. Can fight against the eye. Are they talking about that that lunatic? The lunatic AI? Hmm. <laughs> you don't need to go back that way. The Sinka Deep Cave, huh? Yeah, we've got one of those vats of the regeneration fluid back, huh? Okay. I mean, that's right, but then what? Hmm. Hang on, are those the heads of the... No, what are those? There, there's something on the... Yeah, this is a head. Oh, these are just people's heads. They've been... They, they don't look like people's heads anymore. Henry Dawson, Raw Matter Fluid Maintenance Crew, male, 38. Logan's DNA was a match. Captain and the doctors didn't even blink before throwing him straight in the lab. How far are we going to go just to get back home? It looks like I'm up next. Please don't match. I don't want no part of this horrible experiment. Hmm. Marcus Charles, a ship operator, male, 26. Someone, something bit him. There's a lot of brains here, so I'm gonna give summaries on them. Narasara, uh, Karasara Now, engine room maintenance crew, female 41. No one's coming, it's been 24 hours. Hmm, okay, so it seems like... Yeah, they've been here for... A year? Or something happened a year ago. Morgan Trenton, security male 42. They sealed off the paths to the top. Jeez. That's... So, people were trapped down below? I really want to know how much time has been since this event and when it happened. I bet I could probably figure out a good range from the minds of the, the, the alien species critters that I've run into. The, the people here. Um, Franklin Sanders, head security, male 51. We've already sounded the alarm. Why did so many people still fail to react? And you boofs. <laughs> Mercenaries, my bum. Just a bunch of clowns. Totally useless when push comes to shove. Why don't y'all go back in and die? What? You think pointing your gun at my face will make me... Yeah, I think it did. Ryan Scott, ship researcher, male, 40, 54. Uh, what on earth was Dr. Turner thinking? Setting aside the hidden risks with the plant itself, can we really boost the control rate with this? Doping at such a high purity, the success rates are far too low. Best case scenario. No, there is no best case scenario. If we fail, our home will be gone forever. I have to talk to the doctor and the captain about this. Hmm.
So they seem to have boosted the plant's growth rate. Maybe that explains uh, the question that the AI narrator asked a moment ago, saying how it seems like plants grew really fast, so why is it an, a wasteland outside? Or more of that, um, they, they remarked on how, my, how many plants there were in this facility itself. It's possible that all these plants have been affected by something that causes things to grow at an exponential rate. That's my guess so far. Maybe it's been less time than we actually think. Zach Hamilton, uh, would we still be our original selves after resurrection? I'm not buying any of this raw matter fluid BS. After all, that's some imitation. Even if you could rebuild memories and body data, would that be you? If I broke the rules and made myself with that stuff while I'm still alive, which one is the real me? Ah, yes. Good questions. The answer is no idea. Also, something that I realized is that I think I might want to see about if any of these have resurrection permits, because one of these should. It's probably the gate the <clears throat> it's probably the guy hanging over on this side. I don't know. Matthew Hopkins, security mail, 24. Hold this pathway. Hurry, don't let them in. Back up from the upper levels is on the wait, what's this purple smoke? Ah, got caught up in the smoke. Who are you? Michaela Bennett. Ship medic, female, 40. Uh, Dylan should have been able to handle emergencies like this immediately. Did someone do something to him? Whatever the case, we have to go up quickly. We'll be locked down here. Jeremiah, he's the type of person who would totally do such a thing. Hmm. Got locked in by friends. Or people that you thought you knew. Alright, this one's alive. Logan Williams resurrected. This is not the original one. Extreme, extreme energy experiment subject. How many times has it been? My body hurts so much. So this is what I've been doing to others all this time. This must be karma. God, I beg of you, spare me. Jeez, did they take someone who they originally put in charge of turning into raw matter or stuff and not just give them resurrection permits but also use them for the same thing? That's messed up. That's really messed up. And it's gonna happen again. I figured out what I need to do here. It's a little morbid, unfortunately. Ow. Come on, stop hitting the knee. There we go. <laughs> Here they come. Is it just me, or do they look worse than before? They kind of do, don't they? Hmm. Also, there's something that's been bothering me about this room. Give me a second. It's, uh... These, uh, different poles here that they're hanging from, there seem to be, like, symbols above. Like, there's one, two, three, and E. And then also the amount of heads and bodies per cysts thing. Not sure what to make of that yet. I don't know if that's important or just an interesting detail. There's a door to the second level? Eh, but they've made some strange markings on the door. Yeah, here we go. How does this work? Three? Why? Well... I think I get it. If I'm correct, it should be three, one, two, and then four. Yeah, it is. Uh, the reason, the way that I figured that out was the lengths of 
uh, where, where the bodies were hanging on the rope, which is very morbid. I don't like that. Uh, but yeah, that's how to figure that one out. Well, we're on the second level, whatever that entails. No going back. Not that we've really wanted to at any point. Well, that's it for this episode. I feel like this is a good place to cut off after finishing the difficult puzzle instead of before I end wanting to give up <laughs> like the last couple times. Um, thank you so much for watching. It's been a pleasure. I hope you have a good time. Take care of yourself. And until I see you later, well, goodbye.